Well, happy Sunday, team. Happy Father's Day to those people on my team that are fathers. I hope you're having a great day. I hope you're able to stay cool. Uh, I hope you're able to go somewhere cool or, or uh, uh, spend some time at the beach. This is going to be a great week. We're bringing in Rhoda. Rhoda's going to meet with the lab team, and I can't wait to see what kind of fruits that she brings forth. We're going to continue our expression of gratitude, at least I am, and um, just all the things that we have to be thankful for, still have them on my mirror, still look at them every day, refresh every one of them. And then uh, here's our challenge for the next few weeks. We received our inspection report from the FDA when they were here back in August and November, October and November, October and November, I think. So we received our inspection report from them and uh, they closed the inspection, which is good because sometimes they don't close them. They just keep them open, but they closed them, which means in the eyes of the FDA, we're good. But here's the thing. They sent a letter to the state board stating that if we continue our practices, it could present a challenge to patient health. So in the next few weeks to a month, I expect the state board to be in. So everything that the FDA was in and talked about, um, especially in the lab, we have to double down and make sure that we're doing it, make sure that we don't have any um, potential for cross-contamination, at least in the eyes of the FDA and their inspection report, uh, make sure that we don't have dishes that are put in a place where they're not marked clean when they're indeed in clean. And uh, we're going to start using disposable um, uh, spatulas in the lab. So that's enough for today. I hope that you all have a day filled with love, peace, hope, joy, and especially today, cooling. And I hope you have many unexpected blessings come your way today and always.